Hi guys, it's Dr. Stephanie Wu with the Contact Lens Institute of Nevada. Today we're here with our intern Judy and she is going to demonstrate how to care for scleral lenses using a multi-purpose solution. Today we're demonstrating with something called Tangible. This is a great product. It's a multi-purpose solution that a lot of our gas permeable lens wearers and scleral lens wearers use. Uh, so this is something that we use a lot with our patients. So what Judy is going to do is she's removed her scleral lens and she's going to place it into the palm of her hand. And then she's going to use a few drops of the multi-purpose solution and she's going to gently massage the inside of the lens and the outside of the lens with multi-purpose solution. This is a very important step when you are cleaning your scleral lenses. You want to make sure that you are rubbing the scleral lens with your multi-purpose solution. And what this is doing is it's getting down some of those really, really heavy deposits. So getting rid of proteins, lipids, mucus, other things that just adhere to the surface of the lens throughout the day. So it helps to break down some of those really bad things that can kind of get stuck onto the lens through the course of the day. So you wanna do that for about 30 seconds. Make sure that you rub both sides of the lenses. If you have really big fingers, so I have some patients that are like over six feet tall, these um, you know men that have these really big hands, sometimes you can use a Q-tip or cotton swab, put a little bit of solution on that and then use that to swirl around on the inside and the outside of the lens. Sometimes people will use their pinky instead of their index finger if you have larger hands but in this case you know Judy has smaller hands so she's able to use just her regular fingers to rub the lens on both sides. Now what she's going to do is place the lens into the lens well and then she's just going to fill the bowl of the lens well with multi-purpose solution. The thing that's really important here is you want to make sure that you are filling the entire lens well with solution. Sometimes patients don't fill the lens well enough and what you really want to make sure is that you get the entire scleral lens covered and coated with solution. This makes sure that the entire lens is going to get disinfected and cleaned properly while you're letting the lens rest in here. So after she has filled the lens well and made sure that the entire surface of the scleral lens is covered, she's going to take the lens case top and then she's just going to screw the cap on tightly and then she's just going to let it sit overnight. So each manufacturer has different recommendations of how long you need to let the lens sit in order to go through an entire disinfection process. Most are between four and six hours, but make sure you're looking at the back of the bottle or the box to make sure that you are letting it go through the entire disinfection process. In the morning, Judy will just unscrew the cap and then she'll take the lens out, rinse it with some non-preserved saline, and then put her scleral lens in the eye. I hope that helps, and we'll see you next time. Thanks, bye.